The last piece I'm going to read, I wasn't, I wasn't going to read this piece, but then I realised I'm a fool because I'm in Scotland and this piece is about a uh, Scottish-British man, uh, a Scottish-Jamaican dude, in fact. He was, well, this is the story of his life, essentially. He was a man called William Davidson and he was um, one of the last political prisoners in the Tower of London. Uh, around the late 1870s, he was uh, caught up in a thing called the Cato Street Conspiracy, which was a plot to essentially uh, blow up the government at the time because there was a bit of uh, you know uh, well I suppose it was there was some royal unrest you know not 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 the not that that's happening um, <laughs> these days this is called one black lotus for William Davidson you must not eat from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil when you eat from it you will certainly die Genesis 217 birthed by a black woman dead stock, deemed unworthy to record, surplus produce. Under the watch of a man installed to inflict British justice on us just subjects, the soil in which you grew held lawlessness. So when shipped to Scotland for schooling, you dipped out and sought solace on the sea that was your exile. Upon return and by demand, strong-armed to serve at sea for the crown, yet anchored enough in the law of the land to unionise and make a stand, be a black British man breaking bread in the badlands. From London to Liverpool to Birmingham, a maker, building for the people with his own two hands. Then, with the Peterloo massacre as your witness, and eleven murdered fighting for a voice. You hit the books to stop the crooks, preaching common ownership for the common cause. And it was all for one and one for all before infiltration and downfall. There was a copper undercover seeded a tantalizing thought of, let's blow the government to hell in the style of Guy Fawkes. And before the ink had dried, that scurrilous spy sold you out for highest treason. Divide and conquer works the same from Cato Street to the Caribbean. And in court, you challenge the judge. Would you rather not govern a country of spirited people than cowards? Our radical leaves are dissected, pressed between pages. Dead bodies like flowers preserved for the ages prematurely I want my history blooming and rooted like a living tree. For it is ancient custom to resist fuckery. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, we'd appreciate it if you could hit the like button, if you could hit the subscribe button, and make sure to ring that bell icon so you don't miss any updates from us in the future. If you want to go that extra mile and support us a little further, we do have a Patreon channel with loads of exclusive goodies, and you can sign up for as little as a dollar a month. We appreciate your help, guys, and hopefully we'll see you again soon.